What up guys, this is Rage, and today I have how to bring single player cars online without a lag switch. Now you're going to want to go to the spot you want to bring your car online and make it your last location. Basically just go to single player and come back. Once it's your last location, you want to hit start and go over to the Xbox Game Store. Before you actually go to the Xbox Game Store, you want to pull out your Ethernet cable and go to the Xbox Game Store at the exact same time. Now once you spawn in as your single player character, you want to hit start and go to the game save that has the car you want to bring online. Now once you're in the game save that has the car you want, you simply just go into the garage. For example, I'm using Michael and I'm going to go to the Vinewood garage. And I'm going to grab the clown van and then I'm going to pull out. Now once you're out of the Vinewood garage, you want to drive to the exact same location you were just at before. We like to use the $400,000 apartment, we pull up behind it, and we like to use the third parking spot. Now once you're in the third parking spot, you're going to want to hit start, go over to the online section, and sign in, and also plug your ethernet cable back in. Now once you sign in, it's going to alert you that you need to download a compatibility pack, so go ahead and download one of those, it doesn't matter which pack you download, they will all work. Now once you do that, it'll only take a couple seconds, you're going to spawn back in online, and then as you can see, when I run over here, the clown van is waiting for me, and this is a really, really much better glitch than the lag switch method, because with the lag switch method, it takes off all your RGB colors and, and really sick custom paint jobs that you can do. You know we all got to have those colors. Well, that's pretty much it for the video, guys. Hope you enjoyed. I'm out. Yeah, let's fucking rage!